Hello learners, this is Akash. I completed my B.Tech from NIT Raur Kela in the year 2020. Currently, I am a mathematics teacher. Now, let us see how to solve this given question. Okay, this is a question from circles. We need to find the equation of circle passing through these two points and also whose center lies on this line 4x plus 3y plus 1 equal to 0. Okay, a pretty simple standard question. So please stay with me. I'll make it easy for you. Now, what we have to do? First, take the given two points as A and B. Fine. Our first point is A, second point is B. Now, next. Uh, let us take the equation of circle as x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equal to 0. Okay, fine. Standard form, standard form circle. Chalo. Now, my target is, my target is to find out gfc. Okay, once that is done, my circle is there with me. Fine. So, my purpose is to do that. Now, how to do that? Now, see, it is given that the circle passes through these two points a and b fine that means these two points lie on the circle that means these two points satisfy the equation of circle what is the equation what is my equation of circle this x square plus y square so fine so first i can substitute the coordinates of a then i can substitute the coordinates of b and i can get two equations fine so circle passes through a to comma minus three so instead of x and y in this equation we can use two and minus three shallow so fine so two square plus minus three square two g into two fine Basic simplification, 4, 4 plus 9 plus 4g minus 6f plus c equal to 0. Chalo, 4 plus 9 is 13, 13 plus 4g minus 6 Fine. Mark it as equation 1. Chalo, now the circle also passes through b. That's what I told. Now same, in place of x and y in this equation, substitute 4, minus 4 and 5. That's it. Now this is what I have. Now again basic simplification, minus 4 square is 16, 5 square is 25. And then minus 8g plus 10f plus c equal to 0. Now 16 plus 25 is 41. Okay, so this is my second equation. Now how to get the third equation? There are three variables. So I need three equations. How to get them? Very simple. They have said that the center lies on some line. Okay. What is the center of our circle? Our circle is this. And its center is minus g comma minus f. Now they are telling that this center lies on, this center lies on 4x plus 3y plus 1 equal to 0. That means basically our center minus g comma minus f lies on 4x plus 3y plus 1 equal to 0. Okay, fine. So this point lies on this line. So just substitute it. So 4 into minus g plus 3 into minus f plus 1 equal to 0. Minus 4g minus 3f plus 1 equal to 0. If you see there are so many negative negatives in this, let us make a little positive. Let us make them positive. How? Just take minus common, okay. If you'll take minus common, so minus if you'll take common, then I get 4g plus 3f. Since it is positive, since I took minus common, it becomes minus. Okay, now send this minus here, 0 by minus 1 is 0. So ultimately, I get 4g plus 3f minus 1 equal to 0. Mark it as equation 3. Fine, chalo. Now, this is one equation without c. Now, I need one more equation without c. How can I find it? Pretty simple. I just need to do equation 2 minus equation 1. What was my equation to this? What was my equation on this? Now I'm doing subtraction. Okay, so be careful. Be careful. I am doing subtraction here. So this is 13 not plus. 13 minus 41. Whatever sign. Here it is plus. So it will become minus. Okay, so 13 minus 41 is minus 28. Now see 4g minus 8g is there. But subtraction is there. So sign will change. 4g plus 8g. What is 4g plus 8g? It is 12g. Likewise, here I have minus 6f and plus 10f, but minus is there, so minus 10f. Minus 6f minus 10f is minus 16f. And then c minus c is 0. Okay, standard form 12g minus 16f minus 28 equal to 0. Okay, now if you see this, the numbers are little big. What can we do? We can take 4 common. If we, if we take 4 common, so 4, if I take common, I'll get 4 into 3g. Okay, because 4 3s are 12 and 4 4s are 16. That's why I have 4 f, I mean minus 4 f here. And then minus is there, 4 7s are 28. So I took 4 common, so 7 is left out here. Send this 4 to the RHS. 0 by 4 is 0. 3g minus 4 f minus 7 equal to 0. That's my fourth equation. Okay. Chalo. Now we are going to solve equation 3 and equation 4. These are my equation 3 and equation 4. I just wrote them once again. Fine. You could use elimination method, you could use substitution method or you can use the method which I am using. Okay. In my method, something like crisscross I am going to do. Now, what is that? First, you need to start with by writing the coefficient of f. Okay. Here in the first equation. What is coefficient of f? 3. So, first 3 will come here. Then minus 1. We need to go in cyclic order. Then 4. Then 3. Done. Chalo. Now, next. 
in the second equation also start with the coefficient of f so minus 4 minus 7 3 and then minus 4 okay now what i'll get is g by stay with me g by 3 into minus 7 minus of minus 4 into minus 1 what is 3 into minus 7 minus 21 minus minus 4 into minus 1 is just 4, 4. so this is what i get g by minus 21 minus 4 okay this is equal to f by one, minus 1 into 3 is minus 3 minus of minus 7 into 4 is minus 28 so f by minus 3 minus minus 28 is equal to 1 by 4 into minus 4 is minus 16 okay and minus 3 into 3 is 9 so 1 by minus 16 minus okay now what i'll get g by minus 21 minus 4 is minus 25 and minus 3 this is minus of minus 28 so it will be plus 28 okay plus 28 so f by minus 3 plus 20 is equal is equal to minus 16 minus 9 is here if you can see it minus 16 minus 9 is minus 25 Chalo, so i have g by minus 25 is equal to f by what is minus 3 plus 28 i'll make it easier what is 28 my 28 minus 3 25 so g by minus 25 is equal to f by 25 is equal to 1 by minus 25 okay chalo. now let's do like this let me take one at a time g by minus 25 is equal to 1 by minus 25 and f by 25 is equal to 1 by minus 25 why because i need g and f simple now send this minus 25 here and here also send this 25 here so g will be minus 25 by minus 25 and f will be 25 by minus 25 so g will be plus 1 cancel 1 uh, f will be minus 1 all good let's keep going now i got g and f what is pending what is left out I told you in the beginning, right? I need three things G, F, and C. Now, how to get that C? Pretty simple, okay? We already know what is G and F, okay? So, from the first equation, just put the G and F in the first equation and then you are done. Or you could put them in the second equation also. Anything is fine, you will get the same answer. So, fine. Uh, G and F, you can just substitute G is 1 and F is minus 1. So, 13 plus 4 into 1 minus 6 into minus 1 minus 6 into minus 1 is plus 6 so 13 plus 4 plus 6 plus c 13 plus 4 is 17 17 plus 6 is 23 so 23 plus c equal to 0 and if i'll send this 23 to the, to the rhs so i'll get c equal to minus 23 done okay so i got g i got f and i got c my question is almost done just one thing is left out what is that one thing is to just substitute all of them in the equation which i took like the equation of circle is required equation of circle is x square plus y square plus 2 in place of g i kept 1 into x plus 2 f in place of f i wrote minus 1 into y minus 23 c is minus 23 equal to 0 okay now i will get x square plus y square plus 2x this equation is friendly okay thank you very much for staying with me up till now in case you like this video Please hit the like button, it will encourage me to make many more of such videos and if this is your first time coming across to my channel, please do subscribe to not just this question, I made other questions related to circles as well, you can just check out the description and uh, other chapters also I made something like uh, theory of equations, complex numbers, you can check out those questions also as well. Once again, thank you.